It's Tuesday, November 9th. I'm Allie Hoxie. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. We're monitoring a surge in coronavirus cases in Europe. The surge coming right as the United States lifted travel restrictions for foreign visitors who are fully vaccinated from 33 countries, including Canada, Mexico and most of Europe. Health experts worry both could mean a potential surge in the winter here in the United States. We are waiting to see if and when Pfizer asks the FDA to expand eligibility of its booster shot to all American adults. The drug maker is expected to make the request for emergency use authorization for Americans 18 and up as early as this week. We are watching for a report from the Biden administration on if Enbridge's Line 5 oil pipeline will be replaced. The Army Corps of Engineers is working on an environmental impact statement. The White House is reviewing how a closure would affect fuel prices in the Midwest. This afternoon, a chance of some light showers, high of 58 degrees. It's going to be getting colder tonight with decreasing clouds, lows in the 30s, mid 50s tomorrow. But we're back to 62 degrees Thursday for Veterans Day. Rain moves back in Thursday evening, and it gets much colder this weekend. We'll have a wintry mix of showers, breezy and colder weather Saturday and Sunday.